there, what's up? I hope everyone has had a wonderful week. In today's video, I am going to be sharing with you my thoughts on the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Edit Volume 4. Today I will be showing you swatches and of course I will be applying it on my skin so that you can see how these powders look like. Anyhow, without any delays, let's jump right into this video. I am going to start by setting my entire face with the color Dim Light and it's this color right here. It is described as a peach beige color. And I'm simply going to take the color with a fluffy brush and I'm going to set my entire face with it. Just very lightly. powders give you a very nice finish. They give you a very natural glow. They don't make you look like you are just highlighted from everywhere and that's what most people tend to think. They give you a very natural radiance. I am going to be setting my under eyes with the color diffused light and it is this very pale yellow on the palette. And it is a very nice color. It makes everything look a little brighter and a little better. color and I'm just going to apply it on the center of my nose and forehead as well. And this brush has no additional product. I'm simply making sure that the powders are very well blended since I did use two different shades. To bronze my face I am going to be applying the bronzer filtered bronze light. And this bronzer is supposed to be a little bit on the cooler side. It does apply very nicely on your skin. I've already used these powders before. is not matte it has a very nice natural glow For blush, I am going to apply Luminous Glow. And for highlight, I will apply Euphoric Strobe Light.
this is what my face looks like just by wearing the palette and of course my liquid foundation and concealer everything on my face was set with the powders on the palette and as you can see my face looks pretty glowy but in a very natural healthy way what looks just more radiant is a strobing highlight and that's just on top of my cheekbones. All in all, it is a very lovely palette. So this palette right here retails for $80 at Sephora and the claims are that all six of the powders in this set are formulated with pure photoluminescent technology to capture, diffuse, and soften surrounding light for skin that appears softer, younger, and lit from within. It's everything you need to finish brighten, contour, and highlight your skin in a single compact. So let's start speaking about the packaging, and the packaging is clearly gorgeous. It is a bright pink, and it is metallic. The downside is that this will get dirty pretty fast. You can already see my fingerprints all over the packaging, and... It's brand new. I've only used it maybe four times. I can already tell you though that I am in love with these powders. At first, I'm going to be completely honest with you, I thought that I was going to return this palette. Simply because the size is pretty small in comparison to most palettes that we encounter on the markets nowadays. And this baby is worth 80 bucks, so it's worth a pretty penny. This palette does have six different shades, and the first one that I'm going to speak about is the color Dim Light, and it is described as a neutral peach beige. And the swatch is right here. You probably can't really tell that it is there, but it does provide you with a very natural glow. I did set my entire face with this color today. The second color is Diffused Light, and it is this soft, pale yellow color. The swatch is also right here, and again, you can't really tell it's there. I did set my under eyes with this color today, and it is a very lovely color. It provides you with a very nice amount of light. This third color right here is the Elphoric Strobe Light. And here is a swatch, I have it on my finger. And this is the highlight that I used today on top of my cheekbones. It is described as a pearlescent beige highlight. And for bronzer, they give you filter bronzed light and it is described as a warm bronzer. And here is the swatch, I did apply it on my face today. And there is a swatch blended out on my hand and again these colors are almost invisible but they apply beautifully on your skin and then you have this powder right here and this is luminous glow I have the swatch on my finger and this is the blush that I chose today it is a very natural peachy pretty looking blush and again, these blushes are not super shiny or glittery, but they do give you a beautiful, beautiful sheen. And then for the last blush, you have Elphoric Fusion, and this is a lilac pretty blush as well. And I'm trying to show you swatches, but the swatches simply don't give these products justice at all. So very quickly, here you have the swatches. You have a dim light, diffused light, euphoric strobe light, filtered bronze light, luminous glow, and right here you have euphoric fusion. And that is how all those pretty colors look like swatched. And again, none of them have glitter, at least not that I can detect, but they glow beautifully. 
So here are the swatches of the Ambient Light Volume 4 palette. Let's start speaking about the palette as a whole. And the palette does have six different powders. Each powder has 0 0.04 ounces. And as you can see, the colors are very, very nice. Upon trying these powders, I immediately just fell in love with them. They are very, very nice and beautiful, just wonderful quality. I am currently wearing them on my skin right now. And as you can see, I just, it looks like I have a natural glow. I don't look like I am extremely just beaming from all over the place. And these are the powders that I used to set my entire face. It doesn't look like I have highlight everywhere, but the glow is very natural and pretty. If you want a beaming glow, a just showstopper glow, this is probably not going to be the palette for you. These powders are very subtle, natural, and just radiant. All in all, I feel like I am very happy with this product and I love the way it applies on my skin tone. When it comes to durability, these powders don't do much for my oily T-zone. I don't feel like they control my oil at all. But that's okay because the powders don't claim that they are going to do that for me. They do give me a very radiant, nice glow and that's exactly what they claim to do and they also sit beautifully underneath my eyes. Some powders dry your under eyes very terribly and they make your fine lines look very, very prominent. These powders don't do that whatsoever. They simply set your concealer just wonderfully. And of course, it does give you that radiant glow even underneath your eyes. I can definitely tell you that these powders are going to be a stay in my collection. The one that I am enjoying best right now is Diffused Light. I just really enjoy setting my under eyes with these powders. Again, they are wonderful quality. I do know that upon looking at the size, you panic a little, especially because the price is just $80. But the powders, again, are just extraordinary quality. You pay you pay for what you get for it. and this is just an awesome awesome product to set your entire face with and one of the positives about this is that you have everything you need in a palette you can use these powders as eyeshadow blush bronzers setting powders and they have a very nice steady mirror so if you're not at home and you need to use this palette you have everything that you need in one palette and it is very sleek and wonderfully compact so this is a great travel palette and in my perspective it's also a wonderful everyday palette it's just a win-win when it comes to this product in my point of view i had never tried the powders i get everything a taste of everything the brand has to offer, blushes, setting powders, bronzers. I couldn't be happier with my purchase. And again, the price tag is a little heavy. So to say that, you know that I was very, very impressed by the quality of these powders right here. We've come to the end of this video. Hopefully you found it helpful or interesting. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that bell button for notifications. Leave your comments and requests down below and I'll see you around next time. Have a very beautiful day or a very lovely night. Goodbye.